Hey, what's up guys? This is a Minutes for God commercial break for your day. And uh, I'm, sitting, I'm, I'm over here with my son and we're passing by this building and I'm reminded by the scripture that says, this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us be glad and rejoice in it. And maybe your day is looking like this. Maybe your day is looking jacked up. Maybe it's looking wrecked. Maybe it's looking like you need a little bit of help today. And I want to tell you that maybe that scripture isn't for you today because you feel like everything's a mess. Maybe you feel like, how can I rejoice in my life when my life is like this? Well, I want to tell you that if you keep looking at the problem, if you keep looking at the mess of life, you're not going to get anywhere. But as soon as you turn your eyes and you fix your eyes on God, and if you look where God calls you to look, and if you look where God is showing you and where God is pointing you to look, you're gonna have the peace of God um, uh, with you. You're gonna have the solution that's gonna be the God-given direction. And so today's encouragement is if you're feeling like your life is a mess and that you can't rejoice in the day that God has made, I wanna help you change your perspective today because in God, all things can change. In God, there is hope. In God, there is peace. In God, there is true love. And so maybe today is like, my house is looking like this. My life is built on a ground that is falling apart. But if you start to build from the ground up where the foundation that God wants you to build on, you're gonna have the, the reward that's gonna be due to you. You're gonna have everything that God wants you to have. And so maybe today's the day you need to start. Maybe today's the day you need to start rejoicing. Maybe today's the day you need to start walking in the victory to come. Let's start to put the practices of God in place and let's start to get this show rolling. God bless you. This is just another commercial break for your day. Minutes with God Community Network. Also, as the uh, Let's Talk About It show. We'll see you next time. Are you ready? Ready? Are you ready. too busy for God? Are you prepared for the afterlife? Is God an afterthought or your daily bread of life? Do you have the time for God? Can you spare some time with God? This community network. Minutes with God, don't get it twisted. Wrap yourself up in the law, don't get it twisted. Wrap yourself up in the law, don't get it twisted. Wrap yourself up in the law, this community network. Do you have a time for God?